Hello everybody, this is your friendly neighbor Lisa Foxy, and welcome back to Eastward. So without further ado, we're going to hop right into it because I for one been wanting to continue on back in of course to the story. And uh I'm sure you guys are excited when you see Liza P if you if it showed up for you guys that week, I'm pretty sure it is. And uh I'm excited. I am excited to play that game too. And holy cow. Um Alright, let's make sure we are in the last right correct save. And since we are in a new town today. Hopefully we get a lot done. There's something here. Okay, so we got some restocker ammo and bomb. Okay. So I'm guessing that's free. Ammo pack. Bomb up bomb expansion. Yeah, I wanna upgrade really good in here. Okay. And I also wanna upgrade bomb expansion. Bomb upgrade. So it takes a hundred and three of those chips. Okay. Hmm. All right. Howdy. This here's Greenberg. Mayor's waiting for you. He's in front of Wood Whale. What a weird face. Oh my gosh, she made the face. She got the nerve to say weird face. Oh, so there's Earthbound here. What is this? Nine prize. Oh, I got eight tokens. Mushroom. Okay. Seven. Googly bat. Okay. Have a look, all fresh veg, veg straight from the field. Backpack. I can upgrade my backpack. Yes. We need this. You're a really good shop. A hundred. I'll do it again. I want to get at least two extra slots, always. One for ammo and one for just food. Alright. I've been saving. A lot. Whoops. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This guy's going to be super wealthy. Fifty toast. Ooh, that sounds pretty good too. That's helpful. All right. I like it here. Already. Um, let me make sure I pick up some bomb expansions. Uh, let's 
see here. Ammo pack. I'm still wondering, like, what... Let's refill my... Ammo. Okay. I'm gonna make sure I save. Cause I was quite upgrading a lot. So the only thing I really want to do is make sure that I get one more food to go. There we go. Alright, I'm done spending, I promise. Gosh, it's an outsider. You seen Uva? She's basically this village pride and joy. What's this, huh? These, these mouse fritters. Sure, they look a bit funny, but they taste, they're tasty as hell. Huh, <laughs> she's like, nope. Oh, yeah, those out uh, outsiders Uva was talking about, ain't you? Outsiders, wow, let me see. Huh. Now, you listen up here, boy. You lay so much a finger on our little Uva, and I'll make sure you don't sit right for weeks, you hear? I wouldn't be making threats if I were you, Miller. You ask me. You no match for this fella, eh? You wanna say that again, you knucklehead buffoon? Come on, give me your best shot. I'll show you a real threat. Don't you too, don't you too worry about Punchy Mick Puncher, son, over here? He talks tough, but he's a big old softy deep down. He is Uva's brother, after all. You think I need to talk? Do you think I need you to talk for me? You overgrown lump on a log? Ha! I'll let this fella prove himself. Come by Blimping Ranch later. It's to the east. East of the valley. Then I'll see what you're really made of. Okay. Let's talk to her. Well, aren't you a sight for sore eyes? All that muscle, ha ha ha. If I were 20 years younger, mm, mm, mm. It's here, oh, it's here. The harvest, the harvest is coming. What are you going on about, Ma? The harvest don't start till the day after tomorrow. Don't you pay her any mind now, you hear? Poor things getting on in her years. Can't tell the difference between a goose and a greyhound. Oh my, it's been years since anyone from the outside visit. Are you two from the out, the other side of the mountains? Found some tokens. That's great. What's in here? Okay. Is this the Woodwell? It's huge! Just like the mayor's house. You are right. My 
nice little place. There's the treasure chest. Nice. All right, let's go meet the mayor. Wes? Wes? Mr. Mayor! Oh, if it is an Uva. And looking as gorgeous as ever, I might add. Wes, I wanted to introduce you to someone. This is John, and this young lady here is Sam. John, didn't I see John earlier this morning? Where is the little rascal? This is John, the human, Wes. Oh! Now that you mention it, these do appear to be fresh new faces. Would it be alright if they used the old cabin for a bit? What do you think, boy? Isn't Uva just beautiful? She's the pride and joy of this village, you know? Wes! Oh, the jetties of youth. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Sorry about that, the mayor. He can be a bit of a comedian. There's a small cabin just to the east of the valley. You can use it to get some rest. If you need anything at all, please don't hesitate to ask. We're going then? Bye bye, John. So cute. Party. There's a party tomorrow tonight. What? Shared peas? Whose peas and who shared them? That's scoundrelage. Scoundrelage. Is it scoundrel? <laughs> anyway. It's two peas, you know? Or sacrilege. I think it's sacrilege. Sometimes I truly don't know if you're really this harebrained. Or you just like to mess with me. Hey, are we allowed to enter his house? Well, we are. There's a party tomorrow tonight. You know, a real whiz-banger. The whole village gets together to celebrate the year's harvest. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Can barely contain your excitement, can you? Neither can Granny. Ho, ho, ho. You must be the new face everyone's talking about. And what's it? Why, if this isn't the cutest little lady I've ever seen. The soup? Oh, ho, ho. a special treat for, a go for the god of the mountain. The harvest is the day after tomorrow, you know. Salt. All right. Interesting. Just east from here. So that means if I leave the village. So that's that. I'm so used to like the little boat.
Are you serious? A bar and you perform to perform there? Get out. Why would I lie? I'm quite the star back there. I'll have you know. That's so chic. John, what does chic mean? <laughs> huh? Who's that over there? I'm pretty sure that's what she said, sorry. Those aren't friends of yours, are they? Oh, that's just Sam and John. Ugh, talk about Patsy. They'd fit right in here. Let's ignore them. I want to hear more about the bar. I've heard things, yeah, like the people there barely. Oh, oh, okay, well, she. That was pretty fast. <laughs> so she wants to ignore us, huh? I'd give anything to see what it's like there. The bright lights, the colors. It must be out of this world. Oh, she's, well, she's one of those. To think I'd meet someone up here on the surface. And not only that she's an angel who actually understands me. Let's see, we can't go in here. Let's just keep exploring around. Oh, this must be it. Here's a safe. How strange. You must have gone through quite a lot. There's even there are even more colors in your memories than before. Save your memories? John, look! A bed! We haven't slept in those in one of these for a while. And look! At this ginormous pot! You'll be able to make all kinds of good stuff in, with this. John, John, over here! You can see outside. There's trees, so many of them. I wonder if you could see Greenberg from here. Ah, there it is. Hey, there's Uva. John, John, look, Uva's here. place needs a little clean ho oh, ho oh. John's crazy wicked when it comes to bashing heads the floors here it's different it's best you don't go too far in John Come on, let's go to Blimping Ranch. Bimpling, bipping. Miller always talking about how the ranch is short of hands. Perhaps you two just, just the help he needs. 
Let's go, John. Let's go. Uh, before I forget, stop by the village on your way back, would you? I'll cook you both something delicious for dinner. Come on, John. Let's get done quick so we can eat. Oh, I see. Interesting. So we meet again, youngin. Young uns? Doesn't John look a little older than you? Well, you're a hell of a lot younger than my daughter. <laughs> Anyways, you folks here to help? We sure are. John's a super special awesome digger. Digger? What is that? What I need y'all to do is simple. Coral those blinkings into their pen. The whole damn pastel been upsidy as an upstart lately. Damn near broke all my fences. The mongrels may look sweet as soda pop, but make one of them mad and oh boy, you're in for one hell of a ride. Better you leave the little missy here with me. That bad, huh? Now hold your horses. Those mongrels may look sweet as soda pop. But make one of them mad and oh boy, you're in for a hell of a ride, okay? Better leave the little missy there, okay? You could do it, John. Am I supposed to get rid of him? Yep. I'm a mouse. What am I supposed to do with them? Oh, I see. I'm supposed to hurt him into the pen. Nope. Well, come on. Goodness. All right, all right. I'm pretty sure they're supposed to go in here. Is weird. <coughs> okay, okay. I get it now. All right, you guys. Hurdle yourself. Come 
there. No. You too. <laughs> Herd herding the animals. One, two, three. Four, five. That's it. That's all of them. Well, I'll be. Not bad. Job at all. You're a right old bleepin' herder, you are. That will be it for today, then, boy. Blimp pigs? I think that's how it's really pronounced, is blimp pigs. Blimp pigs are so much fun. I've been calling them blimp blimping. <laughs> Anyways. They're just... They're just like those pot crabs... At the sunny side ranch, kinda. Hot crabs? Mm, sounds tasty. They're so good. They're pot crocs isle specialty. Making my stomach rumble like a hell crazed beast, you are. Why don't we head back to the f to fill up our tums? Ufa's probably got dinner cooked up for you already. Okay. Eventually, I knew I was going to run into this. Okay, quite the walk, but that's all right. John, heard from Miller. Sounds like you gave them piggies what's for. Yes, I did. Oh, it's you guys. Looking for Jasper? He's over there. I wanted to ask him more about the bar, but then those hens dropped in. Hmph. Wow. Heard you quite... Heard you were quite the dynamic force at the ranch. But this Jasper fellow's not so bad either. Gotten much livelier with this young man around here. Two young men, even. And, of course, pretty little... Curl Kwe. This town... Is it... Is it real? I may just be falling in love with it. Aw. Ah, you're back! And tried... And tired... As the wings of a bird, I'm sure. Dinner's ready. Dinner's already ready. Come, let's eat. So the mayor's daughter, I wonder, or maybe they're just really close. Close, close. And that, that is when John raised the mighty key of destiny. 
and plunged it into the bowels of the great piece of machinery. Laying bare secret passage, the evil mayor had kept hidden for many a century. Yeah, Destiny. Oh, wow. What's that, huh? It sounds so cool. The key of Destiny is none other than the great holy rod John ripped from the back of the giant pot crab. I just came up with the name myself. <laughs> Not bad, is it? But back to the story. You see, what no one could have expected. No, what no one in their wildest dream could have envisioned. What's that? At the, at that excited moment, exact moment, the evil mayor would rear his ghastly head and corner us in that tunnel. Oh no! It was then that I knew what I had to do. When a great and mighty yell, I screamed, Run, you two! I shall hold back the scene to speak. That's not what happened. Hey, I don't remember this part. <laughs> How long is he going to keep talking? And just when we got those two together for dinner, at this rate, Uva's not even going to get a word in with John. Emily. Go get that Jasper fella and bring him out here, would you? What? But why me? Get someone else to do it. You and him were getting along, sure, as Syrup earlier. In fact, I heard you say more to him you've said to uh, your pop all year. Oh, that's his, her father. Ugh, seriously, what do you expect? You old fuddy, d duddy stick in the mud. How could you and I have anything to talk about? You want to say that again, young lady? Emily, dear, this isn't about you, nor is it about your father. This is about Uva. This is Uva's big chance. Come now, be a dear, wouldn't you? Oh, I see what's going on. All I've got to do is get Jasper out here, right? I'll do it, but I'm doing it for Uva, not for any of you. Jasper! Oh, Emily! You're just in time. Come, come, sit. I was just relaying a tale of our great adventures underground. Come out for a sec, would ya? I need you to do... I need you for something. But I, I haven't finished the story yet. Oh, for squat. Get out here. What's this? Why are you all waiting out here? We want you to tell us your story about Pot Crock Isle. He heavens, you do? You, I think I, I think I, I'm falling in love. Now then, where would you like me to begin, hmm? Oh yes, how about the part where I verbally accost the des desperately evil mayor? <laughs> uh, hold on a second. You... Would you like to come to my place? I mean, it's not... It's just... It can be quite dangerous on the mountain at night. So I thought letting Sam sleep at my place might be better. I'll um, take that as a yes. Anyways, follow me. My house is just to the north of the waters. Oh, I figured that was her place. It's right by the nice little lake. Here we are. Come in, come in. Ooh, that's a nice bed for her, though. 
He's fast asleep. Poor thing. Must have been so tuckered out. John, let me handle it. So sweet. She's going to grow up to into an amazing woman someday. Let's just let her rest for now. Don't worry. I'll take care of her. What? What are you three doing here? When did you three get here? We've been here the whole time, dearie. Yep, since you put little crucial sweet little head on that bed. <laughs> Intent the plan, girl. Oh, oh, initiate the plan, girl. Sorry. Plan? She said. Just what are you three trying to do here? Your battle uniform, Uva. You need your battle uniform. Battle uniform? You, you want me to wear this? <laughs> you look absolutely stunning. Just like me when I was younger. But it's so, so inconvenient. Do I really have to wear this? Don't be naive. And don't be yourself. Don't be yourself either. Yes, you must be nothing but darling and sweet. As helpless as a baby bird. A baby bird? Got you. Now, you naughty pig. Do you remember what I taught you, dear? Look! That boy straight in the eye and grab his shoulders. Then ever so sweetly say, Oh, my, it's ever so cold. Ah, and I can't take it. Got shivers down my whole backside. Say it again, say it again. Oh, my, it's ever so cold. Wow, it's diggity. You still got the stuff, sis. That boy is gonna fall head over heels for you with moves like that. Enough. Run along now, Uva. You mustn't let that boy get away. Oh, my. John. <laughs> Are you going back already? I I suppose what I mean to say is would you stay with me a while? These lights, they're pretty bright, yes. I installed them myself just last month. Uh I mean no, haha. <laughs> I didn't do it myself, of course. I asked Bowman to install them for me. Do you think you would like to stay here, John? In the village? <laughs> Not that he has a choice. There's a little plot of land behind the barn. Would we would build a little boat there. Grow wheat in the field in the spring. Raise chicken or two. Oh, oh, did I say it wrong? Oh my, is it ever cold? I... no. No good, huh? I'll watch after Sam, John. You don't have to worry. <laughs> we 
Wish I could. I mean, he would take off his jacket, but I'm afraid. Wow. That was pretty depressing there, wasn't it? I would definitely be that gentleman. The, the game won't let you be the gentleman. So, where you could take off the coat and be like, yes, of course, I know what you're after. Well, back home I go. Is he dreaming? Dreaming away. A shorter night does not exist that a fleeting moonlight tis pray tell what alas you, milady. Oh my. Jasper. Yes, it is. I mean, no. I know not this individual whom you speak. Uh, then you are? Golden eyes like spotlights illuminating the crime in the darkness. Fresh blood, a vivid testament to the battle that had transpired. This is none other than I, the Night Stalker! Are you Batman? I see. Um, is there anything you need, Mr. Night Stalker? You cannot hide your inner Tormel from me. Do not let the, these feelings of anguish pervade per your life. Nay, take the advice of this night capped caviar cavalier instead you must never allow others to decide your fate for you should you ever disagree with a recommendation given to you you must say so loud and clear disagree i hmm i think there may be may, there may have been some sort of misunderstanding jasper or, I mean, Mr. Night Stalker. Misunderstanding? Whatever do you mean? I mean, it's... I didn't disagree with anything. Ah, I see. Then you were simply embarrassed, were you? I... I like John a lot. You... l, -l, -l, -l like him? I, that's, I didn't, didn't get the sense at all. But I do have to thank you, Mr. Night Stalker. Thank me. Yes, for what you've just said, thank you. Because, you know what? I do need to take off my mask. There's no reason to be someone I'm not. Take off your mask. Ahem. Yes, yes, I can see now that I was worrying far too much. You can certainly take care of yourself. Now then, I shall bid you adieu until we meet, a, meet next, my dear. Goodbye, Mr. Night Stalker. Goodness gracious, I nearly had a heart attack. That Uva is something. For a moment, I thought she'd seen through my disguise. Pretty sure she saw through it from the start. I'll say. That's... 
that's not possible. You, you don't think so, do you, Emily? I, uh, er, anyway... Haven't you three had enough already? The book clearly likes the guy. Had enough? You say that as though we don't have morals obligations to watch over the village, youngin. I've said it once, I'll say it again. You guys are nothing but a bunch of foggies. Watch your mouth. She does have a point, you know. Perhaps we should leave the youngsters to deal with their own problems. I certainly didn't like having someone watching over my shoulder when I was young. Not you, too. Let's just give it a rest. Uva can certainly take care of herself. Very true. There isn't a man who wouldn't like Uva on this green earth. I will say, though, Jasper, that was half bad. Getting Uva to finally say what's on her mind, I mean. That, I mean, it was all a work of the Night Stalker. There isn't a person in all the world capable of resisting the Night Stalker's charm. Oh my. <laughs> Mr. Night Stalker. There isn't anyone in the world who can resist Night Stalker. So he says. <laughs> John! John! <clears throat> Gotta make sure you guys get your drinkies too if you're hearing all these sounds in my background. Getting something to drink for me. John! Something big happened. Is there any way we can help, Uva? When it comes to knocking a few heads, John's basically a master. Would you be willing to go to Blimp Pig Ranch, John? Miller came running out of the village this morning. Seems his poor Blimp Pigs have flown the coop. Bowman's already left to investigate, but I thought it was... I thought if there was anyone who could help him, it would be you, John. He really went to uh, went to town on those blimp pigs yesterday. You don't think you scared them right off, do you? Blimp pigs are normally very... Don't tell. Don't... Something must have happened to spook them. Spook, spook, spook. You don't think it was a monster, do you? I can't be sure. We don't usually tread too far into the forest here. That's the mountain's, mountain god's territory. Guess you and me will have to put those piggies back in their pen, John. Let's get the Blim Pigs. Let's get to Blim Pigs Ranch, quick. Oh, wait. The forest. It can be incredibly dangerous. Take this. It's not much, but it should at least help against beasts you run into there. Now we have a weapon, so now all that means I need the ammo. Great, you got a bang bang gun. You can find it in the weapon menu. Alright. Also, you, you haven't eaten breakfast yet, right? I made these sandwiches for you. You needed to keep your strength up, you know. Awesome, and she gave me an extra slot. Thank you, dear. She's so kind. And she's been real helpful. Alright. We're gonna save. And we're gonna get ready to face what's out there. So we got a blimp gun. Which is what we're gonna need. 
So we've got 30. I feel like I need to stock up on the ammo, though. But I think we are going to be okay. I'm going to do my best. The fence! Done clean smashed in. You don't think it was the green piggy from earlier, do you? Something tells me. Tells me it's something bigger. Look at you going on like that. Ain't nothing but a little piggy escape is all. All we gotta do is find him again. No harm, no foul. We're here! Oh, Mr. Bowman's here, too. Uva said something happened at Blimpig Ranch. So, we thought we'd drop by and see if we could help. Shh. Look, it's there. That's one. That's a little pro porcupine delinquent. You blockhead, you scared the little sucker right into the forest. Don't worry, we'll catch him. Just leave it to John. But the forest, it's dangerous. Yeah, you'll find more than a few little wild critters in there. All the more reason why we're perfect ones to do it. You should should have seen John back underground. He was a monster whacking machine. Underground? Well, if you're that dead set in it, I ain't gonna stop you. Hey! This ain't some game, you know. Don't think you're playing on playing, playing games by the looks of them. Unless the games involve deadly weapons. Wait, isn't that Uva's gun? I may not know much, but the old feisty cuffs. But I know that Uva got a keen eye on you. On you. She trusts you. Well, then I trust you. So go in there and teach the bad piggies the le lessons you won't soon forget. Aye, aye. Just leave it to us. Just make sure you watch your ammo. Without it, that thing ain't nothing but rusty old stick. And don't be out late. Harvest festivals tonight. Alright. Oh, I think we're gonna handle this pig just fine. Like we can't travel this way. I'm not too sure it's gonna take one shot. So let's see, let's test out this gun. Okay, so it's a, like a shotgun thing, got it. Weird. Got you. Nice try.
heck is that? Oh, they blow up! What the heck? A duck that blows up stuff! Oh, that's terrifying. That is horrifying. Okay. That was horrifying. Right, so what's over here? All right. Oh, I see. So that's how it. Okay, I think we don't need to. Okay. Interesting. That pig. Okay. <laughs> Looks like a little bit of tag team might be required. getting hurt but okay looks like it's a job for her Or not? What's the point of that? I'm not too sure I understand that. Okay. I think I understand now. Okay, okay. And while she's holding that, I can go this way.
Okay, that's why it's important. Looks like we're gonna need a key. I shouldn't have went over here. Old habits die hard. Use a gun. I literally have to aim. Snaps. Oh. Their aim is on point, though. job that was great <laughs> it's a good thing she gave us some sandwich so I'm gonna go eat the sandwich and finish my bombs and a key <laughs> it's so cute how they celebrate. It's really adorable. I really love this game. I love this game so much. It's really cute. I definitely gotta be careful with my ammo. And I gotta be careful how I aim stuff. Oop. Replenished. Really helpful. Alright. Switch back. The slugs. So the slugs are still here. Oh, okay, yep, and that is there. Oh, 
Once I get used to the gun, I probably won't use as much ammo. I what to deal with the eye, but oh, snaps. Mr. Buck Dom Buck Duck Bomb. Okay. Okay. Surprise! Nice try. They're like mimics. Ha! Huh. I knew doing something to them would do that. more to go <laughs> all right so I think I'll stop here but if you guys really love this please remember to hit that like button and please be sure to subscribe uh, so that way you guys don't miss out any of the content I'm not too sure if really stopping here is a good place because I don't know if it actually will save my progress maybe I should just kind of carry on a little more you know I was I was about ready to kind of actually just stop Maybe I'll, I'll try to press a little more. I'll go a little further for you guys, because I, I do want to make sure there's like a save. We got a little loop de loop here. <coughs> Ammo. Very helpful. Okay. Little bridge that helps us cross. Let's go this way. And then we can help ourselves. Go that way. Uh oh. Ah, lucky for me, I waited for the save. All right, this is it. This here is a forest. If you cut down a tree, it will still be a forest. But what if you cut down half the trees? What if you only leave a single tree left? When is a forest? No, a l no longer a forest. Save your memory? Yep. Alright, we made it to a safe place. And I think this is a treasure box? Oh, we got... Okay, that's nice. 
Alright, so... I'm still gonna save again. But, until then, I hope you guys really enjoyed this. I know I did. I can't wait to see what happens. I feel like a boss fight is gonna come up after this. So that's why they're asking us to save. So, until then, uh, I'll catch you guys definitely in the next episode. And please be sure to remember to hit that like button and be sure to subscribe. So that way you guys don't miss out any uh, content that comes out. I just want to say, uh, giving it out a shout out. Thank you, Taj, about that comment earlier about what you said about Starfield. I do enjoy that game very much. So uh, if you're watching this, thank you so much for saying so. But until then, I'll catch you guys next time. And uh, please, please show so much support and love for me. I really appreciate it because it helps other people find my channel. And uh, yeah. If they want to relax and enjoy my gameplay too. So until then, this is all I gotta say. I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Till then, bye guys!